Welcome to the ACT Math Preparation Course, Free Trial Course Video Solutions. Let's take a look at the solution to question number two. The question asks, which of the following is a factor of p squared minus 4p minus 12? Well, when we look for factors of a, of a quadratic, we're looking for two numbers that multiply to the third term and add to the middle term. You may have heard in a math class before, the third term is called the c value, negative 12. The middle term is called the b value, negative 4. Well, let's look at all the combinations that multiply to negative 12. Negative 12 times 1 multiplies to negative 12. 12 times negative 1, that's a different combination. Negative 4 times positive 3. Positive 4 times negative 3. Negative 6 times positive 2 and positive 6 times negative 2. And again, we're looking for which of these pairs multiplies to negative 12. They all do that. And which pair also adds to negative 4. If we take a look down through these solutions, we see that negative 6 plus 2 also adds to negative 4. So negative 6 plus 2 fits both criteria. It multiplies to negative 12 and it adds to negative 4. These will be the values we put inside of our factored form are two sets of parentheses as factors p minus 6 and p plus 2. We use p because it was found in the original solution, the original problem. p minus 6 times p plus 2, if you would FOIL this out, you would get p squared minus 4p minus 12. So which of these is a factor? p minus 6, letter E. To find more solutions, go to http colon slash slash actmath.liquidpro.net.